Welcome, this is Best Buy. Today I'm going to be telling you about how to prepare your car for the rainy season and some safety measures to watch out for. Please subscribe to this channel by clicking the subscribe button below the video or click the tiny red icon on the video and please subscribe. Please also, I would love you to drop your own tips and safety features or measures which I might have missed in the comment section so that we can all learn and enjoy life. First thing to check is your lights. Make sure they are not faulty. As you can see, one of mine is faulty and I never knew till I checked now. This is important because you need your lights when you will be driving so people can see you when they are approaching you and also a car coming from behind can also see you because when your lights are on, the brake lights are slightly on and visible which can prevent accidents. The second thing to check are your wipers and your windshield. Most people never remember to change their wiper plates which can go bad. It is advisable to change these blades once a year before the rainy season. For the windshield, it is advisable to always wash it with soapy water even after the rain might have washed the car clean. In the video, I washed the part of the windshield and left the other. I poured water on both and you can see clearly that the washed part with soapy water is clearer and more visible than the other part. You can also wash this windshield using the windshield washer which is the tiny dot on the bonnet in most cars. All you need to do is to fill the windshield washer with soapy water. Have you changed your wipers in the last one year? Let me know in the comment section. Third thing to check are your batteries. This is one thing that can frustrate you and leave you at a particular place for a long time. So do check your batteries. You can measure its voltage reading to know if it's up for replacement. You should read above 12 volts at all times. Also watch out for corrosion in the terminals too. Is there any way you can also test to know if your battery is almost giving up? Please I would want to know in the comment section. The fourth thing to check are your tires. During the dry season it is easier to drive with bad tires. But once it starts raining, washed out tires are more difficult to grip the road which can lead to skidding and all sorts of accidents which could have been avoided by replacing them. And also, washed out tires tend to get stuck easily in mud. The fifth thing to check are your brakes. This season requires you to check your brakes to make sure they are working perfectly because you need good brakes to stop a car on a wet surface. Change the parts or the brake parts if there is need for that and also check the brake fluid too. The sixth thing to check is the engine cover. Most cars come with a plastic floor cover which covers the engine but most people do not notice when these fall off, especially women. So just check if yours is still there. If it is not there, you can replace it so as to prevent water from entering the engine or your suspension. The seventh thing to check is your air conditioner. If your car's AC is faulty, please try and fix it because it helps when driving under the rain. By removing the mist that forms inside the car when driving in the rain due to difference in temperature. The seventh thing to check are random items you should keep in your car. This is first thing is a towing rope. This can help you or help someone else when they get stuck in mud. Second thing to keep is a piece of stone or wood which you can use to help drive your car if you are stuck in mud. The third thing is always have a spare tire. Make sure your spare tires are good. Lastly, these are some basic driving tips which you should maintain. 1. Try to always drive at a slow speed. 2. Always drive at the center of the lane because there is likely less water logged in that area. 3. Always drive slowly and never stop driving when driving on slippery surfaces like one. 4. Always put your hazard lights on when you park on a busy road. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Like this video too. And please feel free to tell me what I have missed out in the comment section.